Okay, hi students. Today we are going to do chapter 7 about body coordination. Okay, so as usual, we are going to dive into subjective rather than objective or essay if you want to. And we may due to time constraint, so we are going to just do for maybe one or two questions for chapter 7, body coordination. Okay, let's dive into the first question. Uh, body coordination can be disrupted. So our body coordination, if you still remember, is controlled by two things. Okay, one is the CNS, central nervous system, and one is the hormone. Whatever you do, whatever you think, is controlled by either your brain or by your hormone that actually help you to feel or scan your heartbeat go faster feel happy feel high so all this thing is a hormone like you go to Genting you sit in the roller coaster you feel the excitement because when you go to the roller coaster it will secret the adrenaline hormone so you feel like wow hen suang to roller coaster uh, or you sit in the car then nothing or you see some ghost movie okay so body connect can be disrupted of course it can be disrupted by taking drug stick the meaning of drug okay so the meaning of drug a chemical substance that can disrupt neuron function such as by delaying impulse transmission so uh, yes our uh, if you still remember what is impulse Impulse is a message. For example, you are looking at me, there is an impulse being sent from your eye to your brain. Or when you feel cold or you feel hot or hot, there is impulse that being sent from your skin to your brain. So a chemical substance that when you eat, it will disrupt the neuron function by delaying the impulse or affect the impulse. For example, if I poke here, then I will feel pain. If I feel pain. But if I eat the drug, I poke here, then suddenly, eh, hey, why no pain? No pain because it already delayed the impulse. So here you see it's not saying good or bad, but only if you abuse it, it becomes bad. Because sometimes doctors, for example, the doctor use morphine. Huh? For example, morphine to make the person less pain so the doctor can do operation. The doctor wants to cut you. If you know how to cut a little, the person feel very pain. So we just give him some drug and then we cut the person. Hmm. Okay, what is the effect of a bit of amphetamine? Amphetamine. Explain what is the effect of amphetamine? Okay, so uh, what is the effect of amphetamine? You can say that it will increase heartbeat and blood. Increase heartbeat. I just write the simple one. Uh -huh. Or it will uh, make the person more energetic and aggressive. More energetic and aggressive. Yeah. Okay, or you can look at your textbook, page 153. It will make the person confident and feel alert to the surrounding. Okay, the person will feel confident and alert to surrounding. So these are the effect of the stimulant drug. Okay, but if you look at your textbook, page 163, uh, drug is actually divided into a few types, stimulant, make the person more active, or depressant, make the person slow down, or you want the person to sleep, more relaxed. So got two drugs. One is make you very high, the person take already, he, he will like, woo, woo, very high if you if you got see the person take drug. And one drug is when he take already, he will, ah, oh, but like, ah, oh, so relaxed. So you know that it is a depressant 
drug. One more is inhalant and hallucinogen. But two types that we can always see like one is feeling high, one is like very relaxed. Uh, very high one example is amphetamine, methamphetamine. Relaxed one is called barbiturate and alcohol. Name two factor that uh, state two factors that cause drug abuse. What are the factors that cause drug abuse? Okay, can okay, whatever your answer is, it is uh, correct. But you explain a bit, okay? For example, if you stress, say stress. So maybe you can say that you don't write just write stress. Maybe you can explain a bit, okay? The person abused drug due to stress. He he what he do not he uh, yeah, how to explain uh, so feel how like he he do he do not know how to handle the stress so he he might take drug for example and then one more answer is uh you uh, say that for physical health issue okay so maybe you say that he has a physical health issue feeling very painful and stress so he takes some drug to reduce the uh, pain or what okay anyway i go to google because this is keba question it's not in the book what are the 10 cause of drug abuse number one family if your family got take drug probably you also will take drug number two mental health mental health issue you got mental problem so maybe you are stressed, uh, depressed, you are So you might want to take drug. Adverse childhood experience means when you are a child, that time you don't have a very good children experience. Number four, social pressure. Okay, social pressure, work pressure. The book answer is actually peer pressure. Peer pressure, peer info and curiosity. Yeah? Some people, especially Usually drug abuse happen in young people, especially you don't you, you seldom see old people only start to take drug 60 years old. Usually people take drug when they are maybe I don't know 12 to 22 because they are still young. Yeah? When especially 12 until um, age 21, because you're yeah, from children, suddenly you become young, maybe sometimes the teenagers that don't know how to solve the problem when they, if they suddenly have the problem they don't know how to solve then they will feel very very stressed then the then the friend say you take la you eat la you try you try smoke very nice one you try vape very nice so they start to smoke and they start to vape or they start to take drug because uh, their friend influence or what then then after that it's too late already but uh, hopefully Teenagers can go through, you so you you exercise, you do go through. Hopefully when you become adult, uh things will get better. Huh? Because when you become like me, 35 years old, I I learn to I know how I, 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 I got more skill to solve the problem. I got more skill to solve the problem and you must think lah, huh? think how to solve the problem and uh being consistent, think about other people also and and um, and like that lah. Sometimes things happen in life is like that lah. So eventually I get used to it, nah, Because human lah, so you should have a lot of problems. So when some problem come up, you see, ah yeah, the problem again. Nothing new lah eh, in under the sun. It's because every day is a problem. So okay lah, never mind lah. Sometimes like like that. Then I pray Lord, pray to God, please God help me. Ah, like that lah. What to do? Okay. So yeah, so yeah, so there is uh, some way to, to solve. So I just write down first before I forget, okay? Peer influence, I just write here, peer influence and also uh, curiosity. Okay, so usually of course if I face problem, I pray to God, lah, huh? I ask God to help me and uh I, I also seldom tell my friend i i mean i got one good friend sometimes i will tell him but because i'm guy ma, guy and guy ah sometimes got problem ma, because we are guy ma, so sometimes i tell la, sometimes sometimes i don't tell exercise 
read 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 books read bible pray what to do uh, like that lah life is like that lah huh? so until we die also we have a lot of problem so even until 60 years old also we have problem i got uh i got a pastor that i got my church member that suddenly you know the batang kali landslide so they die some people die so i also don't want to say anything like because they go to camp they die man. so so life is like that lah. and also i got a good friend but his son died because of covid so son-in-law died so he many stress you know because now we, you are still teenager but i got a friend my friend is very old like maybe 60 years old but he his son daughter get married and then his son died because of covid so you are father uh, you feel very stressed you know because your son died because of covid uh, you feel very very stressed so life is like that uh, we just need to continue to to grow and live uh, what to do uh, life is like that uh, okay uh diagram one show the androting of a woman ah uh, yeah so i will go through this very fast okay what is v and w of course this one you need to know everything you need to memorize so v will be the pituitary gland pituitary gland make sure you spell correctly uh look at your textbook your textbook is at page let me scroll down a bit uh what page page 146 in your textbook okay page 146 in your textbook you will see that uh v will be the pituitary gland w will be the thyroid gland thyroid gland spell it properly okay I'm, I'm going to write fast. Uh, if I write slow later, you'll fall asleep. Z will be the adrenal gland. Adrenal gland. Make your heartbeat go fast when the dog chase you or when you fall down. Okay, then we have the pancreas. Like the leaf is the pancreas. And then we either have the testis or ovary. Okay, ovary for girl. And for guy, it will be for testis. So all this is the hormone secretion and it has its function state the gland that produce enzyme and hormone so this gland actually produce enzyme and hormone so of course almost all of these produce enzyme and hormone are uh, produce hormone so the enzyme one will be the pancreas okay so it will be uh, pancreas gland x okay so i just put here gland x gland x but it's just one mark only okay just one mark only so what is the function of pancreas so of course pancreas not only secret hormone it's secret enzyme in terms of insulin i put here it's not in the it's not in the answer but i just put here okay it's secret insulin because it's like an enzyme to what to control the sugar in the blood okay control excess glucose so if you're, you got pancreas problem you will have diabetes tang niao ping then then you got many problem that's why don't eat too many rice don't eat too many sweets sweet don't drink too many milo though i just drink my milo or chocolate uh then this will cause diabetes that's why but also i got kit kat here so i watch movie and eat kit kat but i exercise a lot so you see i'm quite thin i don't have a uh, glucose problem because i exercise a lot i only have a bit of high blood pressure a bit lah huh? but so just eat lesser thing but I like to eat char kway teow lah, huh? so yeah, exercise, 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 so that uh, I have a healthier brain and healthier body. Remember to exercise and the religion stuff and do lah. Huh? If not, later we will feel very stressed. Then we cannot blame people, correct or not? Let's say you feel stressed, then you got problem, then you cannot say because he do like this to me because 
You also no go exercise. You also no have religion. You also don't talk to friend. You also no help other people. So if you don't do, then you have problem. Then you don't know how to solve. So before you know one day you are going to have problem. So before you have the problem, make sure you do some plan first. Okay, if I have problem, before I have problem, I need to exercise. I need to have a healthy relationship. I need to have a healthy mind. My religion and you need to have a because one day the problem will find you and you will feel that wow oh, I really cannot cannot solve this problem. So you prepare first. Prepare yourself. You don't. You not prepare means. GG habis. Then maybe the person go and take drug. Okay. Ah, uh, where is it? State the hormone by why. So why is a ovary? So a ovary will produce what hormone? It will produce estrogen. So for girl, I mean for female, it will produce estrogen. So estrogen do what? It will produce the production of ovum. And for guy. Uh, or progesterone. Sorry, I thought it's testis. Progesterone. What is the function? The function is to uh, maintain the thickness of the wall of two uterus for the implementation of embryo. I just put a shortcut, lah, huh? Implementation of embryo. Okay, means to make baby lah, huh? progesterone, then the embryo need to stick at the uterus. If not, the baby won't stick, the, the woman cannot get pregnant. He will just go period and the period will just wash the, maybe the embryo up. And he also don't know because it's very small. But actually the very small thing is the baby. So you make keep yourself healthy. Uh, uh, the, uh, so that... Um, you, you won't have any problem with having baby. That's why sometimes women have baby need to careful a bit. Lah, huh? Careful a bit. Let's say he fall down or people hit him or kick him in the this part. So that's why they say in the Chinese lock toy. Because the thing fall down. Ah, tic -tic -tic -tic. So the, the baby or embryo is supposed to sit in the uterus but it fall down. So uh, uh, then, then the, the baby cannot already. Okay, last question. What will happen if Glenn Jack do not secret hormone? What is Glenn Jack? Jack is uh, kidney, is it? Jack is kidney. What is it? Is is you know, Jack is the or oh, Andrelina gland. Oh sorry. Jack is Andrelina gland and uh if it is not being produced, what will happen? If you you will have less Capable of coping of stress, less capable of coping with stress. So this is what happened if the adrenal gland is injured. Okay, so that's it. Okay lah. So if nothing, then I see you next week. Okay, Saturday or okay. anything you update me lah. Okay. Okay. Okay, so I see you again. Hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Bye bye. God bless you. Thank you, teacher. Thank you.